Hello, my name is Henry Gonzalez, Director of Health and Safety for the Human Union High School District. Please join me for a few moments as I, along with school resource officers from the Yuma, Summerton, and San Luis Police Departments, deliver a very important message about health and safety. Specifically, our SROs will walk us through the critical steps of what to do in a lockdown drill. According to research, knowing what to do in a lockdown helps build skills that will help keep you safe and reduce injuries. The safety of students and staff on every campus is a priority. With this message, we aim to ensure that each student and staff member is well prepared in the face of a critical incident. Further, we seek to inform parents and community stakeholders of the steps taken to ensure the safety of our students and staff. And remember, run, hide, or fight. Hello, my name is Levi Jones and I'm with the Yuma Police Department. I'm an SRO at Cibola High School. Please listen as I tell you what you need to know, what to look for, and what your options are to stay safe during a lockdown. First, what is a lockdown? Lockdown is a procedure of locking classroom doors, covering windows, and moving all persons away from windows and doors during a situation involving dangerous intruders or other incidents that may harm persons inside a school building. Lockdowns are serious incidents and you must know what to do and what to look for. During a lockdown, Everyone on campus is directed to get to a location that can be locked and you must remain there until the lockdown is cleared. Staff will lock doors during this time and you must move and act quickly so you do not get left out. Now let's talk about lockdown indicators and what you must pay attention to. Announcements over the school intercom that a lockdown is in effect. School staff such as teachers, security or maintenance yelling that there is a lockdown or students or staff members running to get out of harm's way. I want you to know that you do not have to wait to hear lockdown before you take action. Remember, you must take action immediately. This is Officer Sosueta with the Summerton Police Department and SRO at the Summerton High School. Now that you know what a lockdown is and what to look for, let's talk about what you must do to stay safe in a lockdown situation. Seek safety. If you're in an open area, move quickly to the nearest building, classroom or restroom. You must move quickly to get out of harm's way Leave your belongings and take only your cell phone. If you walk, you will be in danger for a longer period and risk being locked out of the building or room you plan to go to. Try to avoid moving in large groups and remember to act quickly. This is Officer Vanzuela with the San Luis Police Department and SRO at San Luis High School. So what are the options during a lockdown? Once you find a hiding location, lock the doors, shut off lights, and take position in the corner of the room where you are out of view and away from the windows or doors. If possible, barricade the doors by using a desk or furniture. Stay quiet and make yourself invisible. Do not bring attention to your location. As a last resort, fight. Commit to your actions and work as a team. Look for improvised weapons. Fight as if your life depends on it because it does. Safety is a mutual priority for the Human Union High School District and our law enforcement partners. With this training video, we share the common goal of keeping every student safe, every school, every day. Knowing what to do is key to keeping students and staff safe during a critical incident. So in summary, lock down, remember the signs and know what to do. Run, if you can run, move quickly. Hide, lock doors, turn out lights, make yourself invisible. Fight as if your life depended on it. Thank, Thank you, you and be, be safe. safe.